Hi friends! Yesterday we made our moms a card for Mother's Day. Today we're going to make a book for Mother's Day. The idea for our book is if you could go on a perfect trip for your, with your mom or if you could give your mom a perfect day, okay? Now, I know that with our coronavirus going on right now, a lot of us can't go anywhere. We have to stay home to stay safe and healthy um, and stay away from the germs. But we're making a pretend book, okay, of what you would do if you could plan like a little vacation for you and your mom or um, just a really good day for her, okay? So let's think of some things that moms like to do that you would do for your mom. What's something you could do for your mom to have, make her have a great, great day? Um, something you might do is maybe you could um, go somewhere. Okay, where are some places you might like to go or moms would like to go? Um, they might like to go to the beach, okay? They might like to go where? Does anyone's mom like to go to the store? Sometimes my mom goes to the store. She likes to go shopping a little bit. I'll make a shopping bag. Okay, um, what are some other things your moms might like to do? Oh, maybe your mom likes to go to the movies. So you could talk about going to a movie theater with some popcorn. Maybe you guys get popcorn. Um, one thing that I know my mom really loves to do, and I bet your mom really loves to do, is relax. Does your mom ever say that? Oh, just let me relax. I'd like to relax. Especially if your mom's been helping you with schoolwork, I bet she likes to relax. So for relax, I'm just going to draw a mom with a big smile on her face and her eyes closed like this. Ah, <sighs> so great. Um, my mom also likes to read. Sometimes she likes to read while she relaxes, so maybe I could let her read a book for our special day together. If there's any food your mom loves, maybe you guys could put in your book that you're going to get your favorite food. My mom really likes ice cream, so maybe in my book I should get my mom ice cream. All right, we got some great ideas of things that we can do to be special to our moms. Go somewhere like the beach or the store or the movies. You can let your mom relax. Your mom might want to read. She might want to eat some ice cream, okay? If you have different ideas than the ideas Mrs. P came up with, that's okay. I wish I could hear you tell me your ideas, but these are the ones that I'm going to use to make my book, okay? And remember, it's not a real book of what you're doing for Mother's Day. It's just a pretend book if you can make a really awesome day for your mom. Okay, so we already brainstormed some ideas of what would be a great fun day to do with your mom. So let's think of what we could call our book. Let's say, you could say something like, me and mom's fun day, or mom's special day, or our trip. I'm going to call it mom's perfect day by Mrs. P. Mom's perfect perfect day by Mrs. P. And then I'll fill it up with things that I think my mom would like to do on a day if I planned our special day just together. Okay. First, if my mom's perfect day, I think the first thing we would do is when it was still not that um, hot out, we would go take our dogs for a walk. So I'll say first, we will, will. First, we will walk, walk, walk the dogs. D -o -g okay, and we'd probably walk the dogs somewhere that's really nice and grassy. So I'm going to start by making some grass across my bottom. Okay, and then I'm going to make my mom Now, if your mom doesn't like dogs or doesn't have a dog, then you wouldn't put that you and your mom would go walk dogs, right? So you think of what do you think you and your mom 
would do, okay? So then we'll put my mom over there, and we'll put Miss P over here. Give me a ponytail. I'm gonna put my dog Nala, even though she's looking the wrong way. There's her nose up there. Okay. That's mirrors. Okay. First, we will walk the dogs. Okay. Another thing, my other thing, my mom loves to do, and I love to do. So if we planned a special day together, we would go to the. What do you think, Miss P's favorite place to go? The beach. So I'm gonna say, then the and we e will w l go g o to t o the t h e beach okay so i'm gonna make the sand i'm gonna make um an umbrella okay then i'm just gonna make me and my mom's beach chairs And then you're just gonna see the back of our head. So there's my mom's hair, and then there's like the bottom of her bathing suit, okay? And then I could make her legs stick out this way if I want to. And here's Mrs. P. I'll give myself a ponytail, and then I'll make my legs stick out this way too. There's my foot, okay? Make some ocean waves. Make some drawn out letter V's or M's. They make some birds in the sky, okay? Then we will go to the beach. Okay, next, um, friends, I don't know about at your house, but at my house, my mom does a lot of hard work for our family. She does a lot of um, cleaning of our house, and she does the laundry a lot, and she might do some cooking. So I think if I planned a special day for my mom, I would make sure that she didn't do any of the cooking or cleaning, okay? Do you do that on Mother's Day? You might bring her breakfast in bed. So I'm going to say next she will, I'm going to say, relax. Ready? R -E -O -X. R -E -O -X. Next, she will relax. And then I'm going to say, we will do the work. W -er Next, she will relax and we will do the work. So I'm going to make a kind of tricky picture. Here's my grass. Okay, over here I'm going to make my house, okay? Here's the roof of my house. There's inside my house. In the yard, I'm going to make my mom. This is a lawn chair or a chair she likes to lay out in, okay? And then I'm going to make my mom. So here's her head. Here's her hair, here's an eye, a little nose and a mouth. And then she's gonna have her arm like this. She's gonna be reading a book in the backyard. Okay, and she's relaxing. Maybe I'll put a pillow there because it didn't really touch. Okay, she's relaxing and then inside, I'll make Mrs. P, here's my ponytail. And I'll make me holding a broom. Okay, so maybe I'm sweeping. And then over here, I'll make my dad. He's got a beard. And I'm going to make my dad holding a spatula. Like he's doing all the cooking for my mom for dinner. Maybe we'll make her favorite dinner. Okay? Next, she will relax. We will do the work. Okay, the last super duper important thing on Mother's Day is to make sure that your mom knows how much you love her. Okay, so if I could go visit my mom right now, which I can't go visit my mom right now because since I'm an adult and I live um, with my husband, Mr. Palumbo, and my mom lives far away in a state called Delaware, um, because of the virus where we're all supposed to stay home, I haven't seen her in a long time. So one thing I make sure that I tell her on the phone every day is what? What do you think you should say to your mom a lot? 
you're gonna say, I love you, right? So I'm gonna say last, I will say s a I love you, mom. Okay, so then I'm gonna draw my picture of my mom. And this, since we wrote about, I wrote about my mom a couple weeks ago, guys, this book is a lot like that book, but it's okay, because this one's for Mother's Day. Here's my mom's short hair. Then I'll make Mrs. P over here. Okay, so I made our bodies, so then to make our arms, I'm gonna put my arm going like this, like it's going behind her, and then her arm going like this, like it's going behind my neck, like we're hugging. Okay, and then maybe I'll make some heart decorations. Okay, let's reread it. Ready? Mom's Perfect Day by Mrs. P. First, we will walk the dogs. Then we will go to the beach. Next, she will relax. We will do the work. Last, I will say, I love you, Mom. The end. Well, guys, I hope you like making my book with me, and I hope you have fun making your book. Remember, it doesn't have to be exactly like mine. And if you need help sounding out any words, you can ask someone else in your family, but don't ask your mom because it's a surprise. Okay? If you have to ask your mom, it's okay because she'll like hearing your book. Well, I hope you guys have a good weekend. Be extra good for your moms and happy Mother's Day to all you wonderful moms out there who have been helping your kids do great, great work this whole time.